Good afternoon. My name is Sam Cockerell. I'm founder and chief executive of Libertine. Uh, we're looking to raise up to half a million pounds to support our growth. Now, Libertine makes high-performance linear electrical machines for decentralized power applications. Unlike conventional electrical machines, uh, which rotate driven by a spinning shaft, our machines go back and forth, and they're driven by an expanding gas. This means our machines can be used in engines, driven by combustion, and that means that this technology can sit at the heart of power generator products that can be dramatically simplified because they don't need a crankshaft or, or a mechanical drivetrain. Uh, this is what I'm talking about. So in a conventional small power generator, you have a rotating electrical machine. That's quite efficient. And you have a linear combustion process. That's also OK. But then between these two, uh, you have this disaster area, right? This is a, a whole bunch of mechanical complexity the, the piston and all the details on that, the sealing rings, the oil rings, the gudgeon pin, the journal, journal bearings, the connecting rod, the, uh, the crankshaft, and the, all the other stuff that goes along with that, uh, it's hopeless, essentially. It's very lossy. It creates friction losses, heat losses. It really messes with combustion. Um, and it's very expensive because it's so complex. So that's what it looks like. That's the, uh, the net result, which is under the bonnet of your car. Under your bonnet of your car, that's OK, because you need torque to turn the wheels. In a power generator, you don't need torque. You need electrical power. So you don't need all of this stuff. What you need is a linear electrical machine. We can take the same linear combustion event, turn it directly into electrical power without any of that awful red stuff. This makes it very simple, lower cost, and much more efficient. How much more? Well, for the same uh, heat or fuel input, we reckon this produces about a third more power, right? So really efficient and lower cost. That's a rare combination. This is what our technology looks like in practice. Uh, I should say it's a technology architecture, OK? So we don't make a single product. This is a family of products. Um, this is a uh, linear free piston mover inside a, an electrical machine stator inside an extrusion housing. It's a modular building system built from low-cost uh, 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 common elements using low-cost manufacturing methods that allow us to shape this product uh, around a whole wide range of applications. It's really, really flexible. It's been well demonstrated in the course of 2013 and 14 in the lab, very well proven to the satisfaction of our investors. We've got great patent protection, seven patent families, five of them have granted patents so far, and we've got a world-class team. I started out life working for Cosworth, actually designing the crankshaft and all that red stuff in racing engines. Uh, too bad. Uh, I then also spent a bit of time working for Bain & Company in London before setting up Libertine in 2009. My co-founder has come to join us from Williams F1, where he led the Kurz development team. Uh, and our chairman is Dr. Derek Shepard, who is here with us today. He built Agreco International into a billion dollar business in the space of 10 years. Uh, so we really can make this stuff happen. We've raised two million pounds to date. Uh, we've applied that to prove the technology, to establish our uh, technical offices, um, and to build our first uh, partnerships and uh, commercial relationships. Um, so we have commercial traction now. We've got some great um, names up on the board there. And what these people have allowed us to do is to put this technology into some of these first market applications. Patronus are using uh, our technology, we're working with them to put linear machines into their free, free piston research program. What we have is better than what, what they had, and they recognize that. SEMA Power are using our technology for small-scale power generation in the UK water industry. They recognize our technology gives them something that they can't get elsewhere. Brighton University, building our technology uh, into a lab-based heat recovery system to demonstrate something that can't easily be done any other way. So um, you know, across all these people, we're also working with NIDEC SR Drives, I should say, a global electric machine manufacturer who are using our technology to extend their switch reluctance expertise into this linear, uh, uh, linear space. So that gets us superb traction and first revenues in these early market applications. But the really interesting stuff is on the right-hand right side. The full market potential for this technology is truly colossal because it includes decentralized power and waste heat recovery everywhere. It also includes um, small appliance applications where gas is expanded. That means uh, refrigeration units, air conditioning units, heat pumps, and so on. The market for this technology is colossal. We're going to use a licensing model to put this technology into the hands of global businesses who are leaders in each of these markets to give us global reach um, and to do for decentralized power what ARM has done for computing. 
Uh, we believe we are ready for investment for growth. If you'd like to come and join us on this journey, then please come and talk.